Good morning, staff and students. At this time, we ask for everyone to please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you very much. You may be seated, and at this time, please pause for a moment of silence. Thank you very much. Uh, just a few things this morning, but uh, I was asked specifically by a couple of teachers to continue to talk about Fridays. Uh, teachers are seeing a big drop off in students signing on on Fridays and getting their work completed. So I'm saying that to you folks that are here today at school, but I'm also saying it to you folks that are there at home. Make sure that you are logging on on Fridays. Fridays are considered school days, even though everyone is remote. Different teachers are handling Fridays different ways. Uh, as you get into this now two weeks, you should have a pretty good idea of how your teacher is handling uh, the remote days versus the face-to-face -face days, uh, or if you're virtual, uh, how they're dealing with virtual classes. But Fridays are considered school days, so make sure you are, are handling that. All right, Monday is Labor Day. Going to talk a little bit about Monday this week to make sure everybody understands this is our first time uh, to miss a day. Uh, a lot of questions about that. So Monday is a holiday, which simply means that we will not be in school on Monday. We will not change anything else the rest of the week. If you look at the calendar for first semester, uh, that there's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesdays, Thursdays that are all missed almost equally. I mean, it's not completely equally, equally but it's, uh, so, so the fact that A through D students will miss a face-to-face -face day on Monday uh, will get made up as we go along. We've got Election Day, that's on a Tuesday. We've got Thanksgiving holidays, which are on Wednesday and Thursday, as well as Veterans Day, I think, this year, which is on a Wednesday. Uh, we've got some work days that fall, on, fall in there, too. So just... Uh, don't worry about the fact that you're missing one of your face-to-face -face days A through D. Uh, that's just where it falls this time. Next time it'll be a different alphabet that'll miss a, miss a day. So Monday will just be no school. There'll be no remote learning dropped by teachers and there will be no face-to-face -face that day. So next week will simply be a four-day week. Uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday face-to-face uh, -face for those parts of the alphabet out and then remote for everybody else on all those days. So just be paying attention to how that works uh, and uh, don't make sure you don't fall behind. Uh, teachers, just want to remind you about the student assistance request form that was in the week in preview on Friday. Please make sure you use that for students that you've tried to contact and are having a hard time getting a hold of or falling behind so that counselors and administration and other support personnel can jump on those students quickly and try to get them engaged or re-engaged uh, and get them caught up. All right, don't have a lot else for you other than that. Welcome back. Have a great Monday.